line we had. Later, our stories of the day, including why dry January has been a success despite lockdown. After the break, though, what could be wrong with blokes wearing lycra? 0207 862 222 is the number. See you shortly. Americans use a groundhog, but which animal does German tradition use to predict the weather on the 2nd of February? Is it A, a badger, B, a fox, or C, a squirrel? Find out after the break.
55 or over, you could release some of the equity tied up in your home. My room by room makeover, my home helps pay for it. Our specialist advisors can talk you through all your options and they'll even tell you if it's not right for you. Call us free on 0808 231 2200, legal and general, for a more colourful retirement. The Emma Mattress has won more awards in one year than any other mattress in the UK. And now get 35% off in our Emma birthday sale. Emma. Before the break, we asked, Americans use a groundhog, but which animal does German tradition use to predict the weather on the 2nd of February? And the answer is A, a badger. We had to work for a long time on that answer. We did, yes. I couldn't <laughs> I come up with the answer, so I had to just research it for the last ten minutes. Yeah, sorry, if you were watching and we, the whole channel kind of disappeared, we don't know what it was. It's some, it might have been that I... I revealed these shorts again and that's... You held just, up the shorts. It's too much. So we've only got a minute to ask whether this is acceptable, Jackie. Well, to be honest with you, Jeremy, it's appalling, but I remember the olden days when men used to wear those really skimpy shorts and occasionally bits would flop out. So, frankly, I'd rather see <laughs> men in tight <laughs> I think you're right. You would never wear Speedos, Martin, would you? <laughs> No, no, there's always that, as Jackie says, of the, of the boys popping out of the barracks. But I think what's happened there, Jeremy, is your, your pants broke the internet. And I think, I think that's an entirely uh, rational conclusion. In, in, our, in a lot, we'll return to Lycra another day. We haven't got time now. But in a, in a lovely moment, I could, we had that little photo earlier with, with Cara and Anne and Mike. And this is what's turned out. Now, we think this is that we, we, we're working on our technique here. But that's about as close to a family photo as we can get in lockdown. What do you think, Storm? Oh, I think it's gorgeous. I think it's really, really sweet. And we've got a goodie bag for you as well. I found it round the corner. So this is what you'll be getting. A lovely Jeremy Vine T-shirt. The most important bit, the baby grow. And I'm going to work on maybe a bigger bottle of this, but you'll have to share as of now. But uh, if you want to send us your stories, please do. JeremyVine at channel5.com. We'd love to hear from you. Yeah, and, and if you're expecting a baby, we will try and do the family photo. We'll, I'll work on my photography and I'm sure we can do something for you. And it's just <laughs> lovely to share it, isn't it? Some, some good news for us. OK, stories of the day coming and we will see you very, very shortly. <laughs> Another Groundhog Day question for you now. So which of these things can groundhogs do? Is it A, whistle, B, sing, or C, laugh? Find out which after this short break.